file photo U.S. President Biden makes statements about the National Strategic Petroleum Reserve at the White House in Washington by Trevor Hunnicutt Washington President Joe Biden on Friday will mark three years since Jan. Six attacks on the U.S. Capitol and issue a warning to voters that his likely 2024 election rival, Republican Donald Trump, is a threat to nation's freestanding. Trump, who was president from 2017 to 2021 and led field for Republican presidential nomination, appealed his defeat in 2020 election, leading thousands of his supporters to storm U.S. Capitol on January 6. 2021. The failed attempt to stop the official documentation of the outcome left five people dead and dozens of police officers injured. Speaking near George Washington's Revolutionary War era winter headquarters in Pennsylvania, Democrat Biden will launch his 2024 campaign by saying he represents continuation of the Democratic style of government that Americans grew up with and that a vote for Trump is vote for Trump. It could be a leap into a dark, unknown future. Biden was scheduled to make his remarks a day before the Jan. 6 anniversary to avert a possible winter storm. As president, Biden has previously warned about future of U.S. democracy, including on the one-year anniversary of January 6, and in a fiery speech in September 2022. He called Trump and his Republican followers extremists who threatened to take country backwards. Republicans challenging Trump in the 2024 nominating contest mostly refrained from criticizing Trump's actions that day, because opinion polls show that Republican voters are less likely to blame Trump for his actions on January 6 than they were three years ago. In a politically polarized nation where voters get news and information from wildly different sources, it remains to be seen whether Biden's Friday speech will have an impact 10 months before Election Day. The 2024 race is expected to be competitive, and Biden aides see Pennsylvania, home to Biden's birthplace in Scranton, as a must-win state. He won in 2020 with 50.01 of the votes. Biden's arguments did little to assuage his own supporters' concerns about the state of the economy or his 81-year-old age. 26 of survey respondents say they are not sure or may vote for someone else. Ipsos poll. Biden prepared for the long-planned speech by inviting a group of historians and academics to the White House for a wide-ranging conversation on threats to American democracy. The audience is expected to include people directly affected by election denialism in the events of Jan. 6. According to a person familiar with the speech's planning, on the way to Trump Trump portrayed the 2024 race in similarly existential terms, calling the criminal cases an atrocity and describing Biden as a, although he faces state federal charges for election interference. Trump in recent months has mocked acting like a dictator on day one and vowed to investigate, imprison otherwise take revenge on his politic.